A pilot and his passenger are lucky to be alive after their single engine plane made a hard landing into Lake Norman this afternoon. Queen City News Northeast Bureau Chief Sydney Heiberger was the first on the scene as Marina employees worked to get that plane out of the water. We have quite a few times that planes in the area, they land out here. We have pictures of them stopping and getting fuel at our gas docks, but that's the first time we've ever seen something happen. That something was this. According to State Highway Patrol, a red and white single engine Sea Ray had just taken off from the Long Island Airport when it experienced engine failure. The pilot made a hard landing into Lake Norman. It was only maybe a half a mile. Not far from the Long Island Marina. Owner Ed Pyle says he heard the crash and saw the aftermath. It was just hard to believe at first. I didn't think it was a plane. I mean, I actually thought it was a maybe a sailboat because we just could see parts of it at first. Luckily, the pilot and passenger only suffered minor injuries and were treated on the scene. The plane was towed to the marina and eventually pulled out of the water via forklift. Ebb says he was happy to help in any way and touched to see the response from other boaters out on the lake. It was, you know, it happened so quick, but within just a couple minutes, several other boats came right to the rescue. It could have been really a lot worse, especially if there wasn't people out there to help. Reporting in Catawba, Sydney Heiberger, Queen City News. Today's hard landing was the second to happen in our area this month. A single engine plane was forced to make an emergency landing in the Catawba River a few weeks ago. And investigators say the plane took off from Monroe and the engine failed somewhere over Lancaster County. Pilots said the river was the safest landing spot and nobody was hurt in that incident. National Transportation Safety Board is still investigating.